Hello everyone, in this video we are going to take a quick look at AI job schedule issues. You may take a look at this AI job console where you see the schedule details. Let's go to Adram Integrator Job Console. Here you can select a particular job for which you are facing this issue. Select integration job details wherein you may see different details like whether the schedule is active, what is the schedule name, the start time, the recurrence time, a recurrence type if it is applicable, then recurrence details and the card server name. So this is the first place which you can verify if something goes wrong with the AI job schedules. You can always check if the start time in the history tab matches with the start time. So here you may see the job run history. Currently it's not showing for my job but uh, in your case it will show you the job history and you can verify those details. So next piece of information which you can take a look at is the AR system job form. AR system job form is the backend form which holds uh, the information about this AI job schedules which has got uh, different fields which are talking about the schedule information. So once you open this form, you can make a new search with the job type as Pentaho, job name as your schedule name. Okay, and then you can verify if the previous collection time, if what is the previous collection time, if it was set to the scheduled start time on the day it was supposed to start. So these are the different fields which you can verify and you may accordingly uh, verify your job schedules and the type of recurrence and that information will give you idea, give you an idea like what's going wrong. The next thing comes into picture is that the escalation okay HG schedule job escalation again which is responsible to trigger these jobs properly so here in the dev studio you can verify whether this particular escalation is enabled what is the pool number defined or is there is there a pool or there is not a pool number defined for this you can try to run the job manually. If the job runs manually, then that may give you an idea, okay, the issue is only with the schedules and not with the job. So you can start looking at the, the few logs like AR Java plugin logs, AR cart logs. To, to look at the connectivity side issues, if you are working with high availability setup, then you can look at mid-tier Tomcat logs as well. We always recommend to uh, use this Atrium Integrator Console Manage Job Schedules to deal with uh, AI job schedules. You can create, edit, modify job schedules from here. Please do not play around with AR system job form unless uh, BMC recommends you to do any changes to that form. As an additional steps, you can also avoid keeping too many inactive schedules okay uh, you can only have essential job schedules uh, in your AR system job forms if you are working in a server group setup you have option to execute the job using default card server uh, like we see here you have an option to run the job using default card server okay so here for the job ex uh, to, to execute the job properly uh, please make sure that the Atrium Integrator server name in UDM execution instance form is set correctly. These are the few hints tips uh, to deal with Atrium Integrator job schedule issues. I hope this video is helpful. Thank you for watching this video.